summer has arrived, and a familiar voice can be heard again at many lakes in the area. The common loons have returned to their breeding grounds to nest. This is one of the only times that the loons will come up onto land. Both the male and female will take turns incubating the eggs for the next 28 days or so. Though the chicks can swim immediately after hatching, they will spend much of their time over the next 10 to 12 days riding on their parents' backs. Both parents will be very busy catching foods and feeding the chick, which will feed mostly on small fish, leeches, crayfish, and eels. The loons are on high alert as something has their attention. A bald eagle sits in the trees overhead. Eagles are one of the top threats to the chick. But eventually, the eagle would fly away, leaving the loons to go about their business as usual. Eagles are not the only threat to loons and their chicks. Visiting loons have arrived on the lake. These visitors will sometimes try to kill a resident chick. The resident adult pair swims to meet the visitors. The loons place their faces in the water, watching for any attack from below. Any physical confrontations usually take place underwater. They will use their sharp bills as a spear. As a defense, they will also begin their penguin dance as a sign of intimidation. All of the loons swim around each other nervously, but this time there were no casualties. The resident pair escorts the visitors away from their chick. After several hours, they would leave, and all is calm again. The chick is growing fast. It won't be long before the parents will no longer allow it to ride on them. Though the chick will have to spend the days ahead fending for itself, for now, there is no safer place than on its mother's back.